Okay, all right, and we're back. You got some coffee? I got some coffee. I need to do that at the end of this next day, I'm pretty sure. Because I spilled part of mine on myself, like an aforementioned <laughs> yeah, <it> winner. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely a winner move I've ever heard. Oh, Clint, you can't just be outside my door, dog. You can't. <laughs> You got Legitimately <laughs> startled, I heard it. Get out of my crops! I hate you! Our you... parsnips are done, though. Oh, nice. Yeah, I, I would like a furnace. You sad sack. <laughs> <laughs> Give me your blueprints, I'm not gonna thank you. <laughs> you can thank me for not slapping you with my uh, paragon or renegade fist. <laughs> Just on instinct, walking out of this house. <laughs> So I'm keeping one regular parsnip and one gold star parsnip, and then I'm throwing the rest in the money bin. Nice. Okay. Okay. Or a cat. A cat. Yep, yep that's Ashley. <laughs> you have to say hi to the cat every day. <laughs> every single day. And even though it sounds like uh, the cat is saying meow, it's actually saying Leon! <laughs> <laughs> Get this one on the outside here. Around the outside. Outside. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that one is nice. excellent. Synchronized. <laughs> yep. So I have some stuff for Gunther. It looks like we have enough wood now that I can craft myself a box, but we'll still have enough to get across. We can manufacture the, the beach bridge if you find yourself but I think fishing. We should, I think we should save that. and I think Because I think we should get the chicken coop. Oh, yeah. Quick. Yep, that makes sense. But if we get a chicken coop, we also need a silo. Yeah, that's clay, copper, and stone, is stone, it? Stone, I think, yeah. yeah. Okay, so I think tonight we'll get the scarecrow. Surely. Uh, I think I think we'll level up, so we should be able to get the scarecrows. And that's when I think we'll go buy more seeds. I think we should plant another round of parsnip to see if we can get more gold star. Yeah, that makes sense. Do we have enough cash to where we could just go ahead and... I mean, with $600, is that enough to get a, a big old mess of parsnips today? Well, they want us to see if we get uh, unlock the fertilizer first. Oh, so yeah, that we makes can sense. fertilize the new crops. All right. Uh, yeah. So I will uh, get back in the mine. I'm, so I'm going to head over to Gunther's. Well, I'm going to go to Clint's. <laughs> Sorry. I, I, it's so hard to not sound disappointed when I say that. <laughs> I know. It's just, it's just so sad. Oh, I can't build a furnace. I need more copper ore. Okay. So I'm going to go to Clint's, open up this geode, go to Gunther, hand him all of this treasure like Indiana Jones. Mm -hmm. Uh, and then get back in the mine to try to find enough to craft the furnace so that I can make the copper bars. Oh, oh my oh, gosh, dude. We did it. Yes, yeah. we did it. We did it. All right, so before you do all that, mm -hmm. yep. <laughs> we're going to go in there and we're going to plan. <laughs> mm -hmm. Are we going to get 30 or 60 seeds all at once right now? Oh, God. Check your quests. Did you get the getting started quest complete? Uh, well, apparently I've missed a whole bunch of, uh, <laughs> apparently, so I just got us $250, head to the beach, uh, getting started, cultivate and harvest a parsnip. Yeah, I didn't let you pick one. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's all right. Well, we're going to plant more. I'll just remember to grab one. Yeah. Next time. Craft a Oh, furnace. yeah, that's, we don't actually, we don't actually get to do anything in the center yet, because now, overnight, the wizard will be like, come speak to me because I know how to translate runes or something. <laughs> and then we're going to do uh, a bunch of mushrooms. <laughs> yeah. So, okay, so I'll go back to my, my original plan of yes, going to Clint, uh, even though he scared me earlier. <laughs> scared isn't right. He just, he depressed me suddenly. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Oh, gosh. I just, before I've had my coffee, Clint. Hold on, Willie. Hold on. All right, you know how there's the help wanted posters, right? Yes. L listen, listen to this request. Okay. Need Joja Cola to skewer on a shish kebab. What? <laughs> you're telling me, you're telling me you're gonna get a real sharp stick and drive it through <laughs> lengthways through a soda can like that's gonna work. <laughs> and to what not purpose? Accept Willie, I cannot accept this quest in good conscience. I cannot allow you to do such a thing. I will not aid and abet a crime against humanity. And what is the goal? I don't <laughs> the goal roasted the what? Joja Cola? I guess. Uh, oh, come to the beach. Come to the beach. Oh, yeah. come to. The, that's right. I gotta go to the beach. Uh, also, if you go to Gunther, he's got nine cauliflower seeds available. Hey. <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, because I just finished. Uh, I just finished the. Hey, Ted. Good morning. Good morning. Great to see you. Hello. This is not Warframe. You are correct. Um, <laughs> I will probably be doing Warframe this afternoon. Shifty and I will be will be farming until right about one o'clock ish or so. And Around then, there, yeah. yeah, and then I'm gonna eat some of that naan I was talking about earlier, and then um, the goal is to come back and then do some more frame uh, this afternoon. Oh yeah! All right, I also got nine nine cauliflower seeds. We have 18 cauliflower seeds aggregate. Yeah. So we're still gonna wait for tomorrow to see if we can get the fertilizer and scarecrow recipes. Yeah, it would be nice to if have not, our we'll stuff. Just... <laughs> yeah, just to stop getting our stuff eaten. Is it too early to start thinking about? planting the cauliflower in a grid such that we might get giant cauliflower. How does that work? If you have cauliflower in a in a 9x9, nine nine, or as long as your cauliflower is in a square shape, there is a chance that a 9x9 nine nine section will grow together into a gigantic cauliflower. Of course we want to do that. I had no idea that was a thing. Yeah, uh, the first that time... That sounds awesome. The first time I saw it, have, I did it totally by accident, and I thought it was a a mistake <laughs> <It's> like, <laughs> but what you get is so the nine by the uh, sorry it's three by three nine total three by three square has a chance of turning into a giant uh but only cauliflowers pumpkins i forget exactly but in the springtime only cauliflowers have a chance of doing it so if we have 18 cauliflower we should do it in a three by x grid yeah Six, I suppose. <laughs> if we have 18 <laughs> cauliflower. Yes. <laughs> so should we make two separate three by threes? I don't think we need to. I think the way it okay. works is any three by three construction has a chance, but the chance is very low. Yeah. Uh, so I think we just want to maximize the total number of three by three areas that it can choose from. Mm -hmm. So I'm throwing my cauliflower seeds. You said we have daffodils already? Can I sell this daffodil? Yeah, we have daffodils. Okay. Pocket daffodils going into the box. <laughs> All right. Oh, damn. I got a purple sardine. Whoa. Like purple quality sardine. Are sardines hard to catch? No. <laughs> <laughs> they just kind of sit at the bottom most of the time. Okay. So we can turn that particular pocket sardine into k k k k k cash k k k money. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I literally didn't have to do anything to this fish. <laughs> <laughs> that fish was Eric. dead already. <laughs> like, you know, usually you gotta move around at least a little bit, and I just didn't touch my mouse. <laughs> you usually have to touch. Usually you have to move around a little bit. Name of my sex tape. Am I right? Oh man, Robin and Demetrius just looking into the abyss. <laughs> Demetrius, I'm not listening to your science gobbledygook. I'm a farmer, for Christ's sake. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Wesker's got that fish. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Heading down. Floor five. This is where the adventure begins for Leon. I wonder if I'm going to run into a tiny tyrant down here. Oh, what's that dude's name? First of all, I guess first off, I should say, have you played Resident Evil 4? Me? Yes. I actually have not. Okay. Well, there's, a, there's a section where there's a guy who is Napoleon. <laughs> 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 he's not Napoleon, but come he's on. Na he's Napoleon. But, but like, you're not fooling. <laughs> yeah. You know, I'm glad that after the events of Resident Evil 4, Wesker and Leon just could get past the differences. Yeah. Settle in on a farm together. <laughs> Ultimately, they decided that they had more in common than they had, you know, keeping them apart. <laughs> That's so silly. <laughs> you ever just start a bit and you're like, this is, this is dumb. Like, this just, is... Like, shouldn't, do, shouldn't start this one. <laughs> uh, so I've definitely started bits, but usually my instinct goes the other way. It's like, the only way I can do this is to just tunnel to China. Just... <laughs> Lean in so far that ultimately it enters the zeitgeist. <laughs> and, uh, that's, that's what we all want. Yeah. To penetrate the zeitgeist. <laughs> yeah. I should, really should have used my energy more efficiently. I forgot how little energy fishing takes. Does it really take? Is it it's just a low... I guess that makes sense on account of it's a relaxing hobby for most. Yeah. I, this is basically all I've done all day and I have still half energy. Oh, nice. Yeah, I, I've never really understood the, the game logic behind pickaxing is tiring. I mean, that, that makes sense. Inherently, pickaxing being tiring, that makes sense. 
but swinging my sword and combat does not cost energy nah, at combat all. Combat is just a joy. Just waiting through your enemies. Yeah. <laughs> it just fills fills you with joy, so it's not it's not exhausting. <laughs> Inventory's full. Time to go. Throw all these in the money bin. Oh yeah. Oh my gosh. What floor am I on? Nine. I make around. Make around one k, I think. Off these pocket fish. Doing some demolitions here, <laughs> real quick. <laughs> got to make some room in the old inventory. Oh, it's eleven o'clock. I need, it's but I eleven. Need... Yeah, you gotta, you gotta run. Yeah, but I need this copper. <laughs> I get, <laughs> I need it. I need it. <laughs> and okay, so this is another thing I'm interested to see. I, I've made it to, I made it to floor ten in the mine. If you come. I'm interested to see A, does your elevator go as deep as I've gone? And B, I'm do you sure also get a set of leather boots? Because that's the reward for making it to floor 10. I am going to die on the run home. <laughs> hey, the cat's with me. What? Ashley. Sleeping on my feet. <laughs> but, but, this is fine. No, you know what? This is fine. We're best friends. <laughs> Leon and Wesker are best friends. This is fine. <laughs> I'm not getting jealous. I'm no. not getting jealous. I'm, I'm real chill. <laughs> What is the opposite of extra? Is it basic? Or is it chill? Or... I guess it's chill. Yeah, I haven't... The, etym the etymology of slang, I'm, I'm behind the curve still. <laughs> Ever's mood really never, threw me I've off my game. About it in terms of, never thought about it in terms of opposites like that. Yeah. Uh, I don't basic know... Basic fertilizer and a scarecrow. <laughs> Holy crap, we made a thousand dollars.